Dear brothers, uh, our beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He stood up on Mount Safa and he announced his prophethood. Do you know what the first announcement he, he made? Anybody? What was the first announcement he made on Mount Safa? So you say again? Enemy is coming from the other side of the... Yeah. <clears throat> so that was the news here. Yeah? The announcement he made. He stood up on the Mount Safa to announce his prophethood. <coughs> yeah? So he said, Ayyuh O oh, people, accept the kalima, you will be successful. But before that, before he announced his prophethood, he made another announcement. And that announcement was, Trust. he said, I spent 40 years in you. Yeah. Any complaint? Any issue? Anybody to raise finger upon me? Did I do this to anybody? Did I do that to anybody? So nobody, nobody raised finger upon him. And everybody said, you are Sadiq and Amin among us. Yeah. You are the Sadiq and you are the Amin. Trustworthy and truthful. We don't know anything else about you. In last 40 years, yeah. when they testified his... Uh, Honesty, his truthfulness, yeah, his amana, his trustworthiness. Then he made announcement of his prophethood. So he presented his akhlaq first. He presented his character first. He presented his social life first. His behavior, his attitude, his dealing. He presented that one first. When everybody testified, then he made an announcement of his prophethood. <coughs> yeah, if you believe in me, then I'm going to announce that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has sent a message for you. So brother, uh, the point is, before we make da'wah, before we invite people to our beautiful deen, we have to present ourselves first. I am the deen for them. I am the book for them. I am the message for them and we have to present ourselves first. If we claim that our deen is the best deen in the world, then why I'm not the best person in the world? That's the question. If my deen is the best deen in the world, I should be the best person in the world. Simple. Today. Our competition is not in Salah. Our competition with other nations in the market is not in the Dili Quran. Our competition is not in the fasting and giving zakat and these things. <laughs> Our competition with others is in social akhlaq, mannerism. And we are lacking in that one. As a ummah, I am talking to you. We are lacking in social akhlaq. Yeah? So, if my neighbor is non-Muslim, for example, and I invite him to accept my deen, obviously they will think twice. I am better than him in everything. I don't lie, I don't cheat. Yeah? So, I don't snatch other people's rights. I don't disturb others. I'm honest more than him. So, I'm simple more than him. They are simple like Jalebi, yeah? <coughs> so, why I, I accept his deen? Obviously, they will think twice. So, everybody is, will check me and you by our social akhlaq. 
my salaan my namaz is for me it's not for somebody else my fasting is for me it's not for somebody else yeah my ibadat is for me it's not for somebody else they will judge me by my akhlaq my dealing my attitude my behavior yeah so we need to improve our social akhlaq we need to compete them in the market with the social akhlaq so that's the stuff we need for 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 the current market so may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us ability to improve our social akhlaq and may allah give us ability to be the best person in the world to present the best deen in the world jazakumullah khairan barakallahu feekum